So over the past year, what are the more significant changes that you've witnessed in the cybersecurity industry? I think the, the, the term cyber itself has become much more prevalent and uh, I think there's a lot of confusion actually in, in the industry as to what that means. It's, it's actually a, a bit of a subset of what people have already been doing. So information security management in its broader sense uh, is still the same and cyber is now a subset within that. But cyber is obviously the buzzword that's become uh, evident everywhere but uh, overall it's a good thing because it's raising the awareness in industry and, and within the public space as well. So people at home, um, kids at school, all becoming much more aware, which has got to be a good thing. And what's the biggest challenge facing the industry as we move forward? Yeah, well, one of the largest challenges we've got is actually people. We don't have enough people in the UK or even probably globally to combat the threats we're facing in, in cyberspace and, and, and security in general. We, we have limited resources and limited skills and it's a big gap that's currently working its way through schools and universities and into industry but it's going to take some time to actually come to fruition and give us the number of people we need to deal with this situation. So tell me a little bit about this year's rally and what's the theme, what's going on? So this year White Hat Rally again supporting Bernardo's, uh, we're going to go to France. So we're leaving from Portsmouth on Thursday the 15th of September, spending three days abroad and coming back on the evening of Sunday. So last year we raised over £50,000 for Bernardo's in the three days. We're hoping to far exceed that this year. We've already signed a number of corporate sponsors and uh, we've got pledges from teams who are just now in the process of starting up. So I'd encourage people to take a look and get involved early. Getting involved early keeps the costs down and gives you the maximum exposure if you're in it for the branding and the, and the corporate side. We've also got very targeted CSR programs where we can match up um, enterprises with specific projects, which means they know exactly where their money is going within the Bernardo's network. Fantastic. And we're here at this year's CrestCon and IISP Congress. What do you think about the event? What is it that you enjoy? Yeah, it's a fantastic buzz at the event this year. More people, more exhibitors. I think the level of engagement has, has been superb. Um, it's clearly recognised now as the place to come uh, for the technical briefings and the, the, and the broader briefings as well. So I think it's going from strength to strength and uh, next year I think we're going to struggle to fit in. Thank you very much, Martin.